Hello, my name's Chris, and I'm a field service worker specializing in electronic repairs. Now, my company runs JD Edwards Enterprise One, and one of the slick new tools that they've given me to help optimize my daily workload is called the JD Edwards Enterprise One application for iPad. I'd like to walk you through this application and show you how it helps me to perform my daily job tasks. Now, the first thing I do when I jump into my van every day is break out my iPad and open up the Enterprise One application directly off my wallpaper. You can see when I come into this application, it displays some common things I may do, such as time entry or expense entry. But today what I'm after is my favorite application, Work With Field Services. So I can open up my carousel. With a flick with a finger, I can navigate over to my favorites. And I can see there's my Work With Field Services application that I can just press on and launch the application. Now when this application loads, it gives me a list of the daily jobs that I need to do. This is the list I have today, and I can see I've got about 13 records that, that are available. Now, not all of these jobs are created equal. You can see that the third record down is a high priority one about lightning striking a building. Let's drill into that job. When I go into this application, it tells me some basic information. It looks like lightning struck in a Frida server, a Dell XP410. It sure would be nice to have some more information on that Dell machine to make sure I've got the parts in the van to work with it. So I can easily just select on a schematic that somebody in the support line has put into here. Uh, it looks like it probably will be something to do with the power processor or main power connector. You know, I've got the parts in the van for that, so I think I'm set. I can go ahead and get, get on to this job. Next thing I want to do is be able to figure out how to get to where I'm going. Luckily, I can just take a quick exit and it loads the, exit, the address into the local maps. Hmm, up there on Richmond Hill. You know, I know it's pretty notorious for parking up there. Why don't I launch a street view to see if I can find some parking that I may be able to access. Yep, looks right there. There's a couple park cars parked. I bet this time of day I should be okay. Why don't I figure out how quickly I can get over there in the directions. Hmm, I can do a couple of quick exits here. It gives me directions from where I am right now to the site. And I can see, yep, it's right up Queens Road. Take a right on Richmond Hill. I should be there in no time flat. Great. Let's get up there and start working on the job. So now what I can do is go um, get on site, start working on the job, and I've been able to fix it in record time. Now, one of the things that my company dictates is that we need to start taking documentation to ensure quality and liability that the job was actually done. Now, luckily, with this iPad application, I have access to get into my media objects, and I can add a file associated with this job. And you can see on the bottom, I now have camera access, either to anything in my photo library or into the camera itself. So you can see I'm taking a look at the server that I fixed right here. Let's focus on the power connector that I fixed up on top. I can take a picture of that. Yep, it looks good. I'm going to go ahead and use that, and you can see it automatically adds that into my work order with one single step. As soon as that reloads, I can go ahead and take a look at it, save that record, and now I'm ready to go on to do my next job. So you can see how efficient this application is and how it's helped me do my job. Thank you very much.